But I want to temper those those celebrations a little bit because guys we're not finished there is one election still to go in Louisiana that we've got a runoff that's going to happen in uh, in about a month a few weeks uh, and that'll be Mary Landrew versus uh, Cassidy because Cassidy won versus Maness there um, and it's gonna be you know it's gonna be a tight race because Mary Landrew's been the Democrat senator from Louisiana for many years she is the She's the daughter of a former governor, and they've got a whole legacy thing going on there. Um, and in fact, Mary Landrew gave a really, I mean, just a, a killer press conference earlier this week. Uh, she and about, I don't know, nearly, nearly, a, nearly 10 people were gathered in front of a microphone in front of a building with some signs that they had printed. Where was Bill? And she was talking about basically slamming. Bill Cassidy for not really being around or being responsible or responsive to the needs of Louisianans uh, during Katrina. She was touting her own efforts on behalf of uh, New Orleans, new uh, people from New Orleans <laughs> after after Katrina. So was, you know, where was Bill? The signs were all printed up. Where was Bill? They had obviously thought about this and and knew that Bill was nowhere to be found. Well. Sure, he was actually. Let me let me read his tweet. Um, Mary Landry wants to know where I was during Hurricane Katrina. He was setting up a surge hospital for refugees. So, <laughs> loser, loser, we have a loser. Uh, yeah. Did, uh, question. Question. Yeah, hell for loser, Landrew. <laughs> I, I have a question. Um, did uh, did the campaign manager for Wendy Davis just go across the Texas border to Louisiana? I'm just, <laughs> just curious there, because it's like a same tactics. At this rate, they're going to find a picture of of him, you know, rescuing a puppy from the rising waters or something. <laughs> Yeah, exactly, exactly, and she'll and and we'll we'll put it right by her signs. Where was Bill? Well, Bill was saving a puppy. <laughs> no, she will yeah. put it out that he tried to drown a puppy. Oh, okay, yeah, she would. Bill Bill Cassidy hates puppies. Yeah, I was rescuing the puppy, Mary, but whatever, <laughs> whatever. And then we see the story that the Democratic Senate Committee is pulling their advertising from from Louisiana, and then. When that hit the news, then the then the Democrats come back and say, no, no, that's not it. It's that, um, well, we were anticipating that the ads would be way more expensive, so we had allocated a lot of money to these really expensive ads, but turns out they're going to be a lot cheaper. So, yeah, that's why we reduced the budget of money we're spending in Louisiana. Okay, sure. And that at the same time that we're seeing stories that Reince Priebus and the GOP are putting together a unity rally, bringing together Tea Party groups, you know, the libertarian Rand Paul side of things, the Tea Party uh, Ted Cruz side of things, and the more establishment side of things with Bobby Jindal and all of them coming together in a big rally to bring all of the Democrats together and Bob and um, Maness very quickly after losing to Cassidy um, in the election last Tuesday, uh, Maness has very quickly come in and said, I am fully behind Cassidy. I want all of my voters to support Cassidy. So the GOP is doing all of this unity stuff to just kick his butt, kick her butt. So that ought to be pretty fun. And To be fair, she does look like a man. Yes, she does. Oh, I, I got confused. But not that war there's on anything. women. We just got over the war on women. You're dragging it back into... Ah. <laughs> this is it. Media matters. We're sunk. <laughs> yep. It's, it's done. You cannot criticize a Tea Party without being called a rhino. You cannot criticize the establishment without being some, you know, whack nut.